All right, how's it going? Uh, today we're going to be working with series circuits, and we're going to be solving for current in this first problem. So let's just get started. So in this problem, we're going to be solving for current, and here's the circuit we're going to be working with. So you have just uh, one resistor, one power supply, and this is a 12 volt power supply. So the voltage of the supply is equal to 12 volts. And the resistance of this resistor is equal to 6 ohms. And we want to solve for the current. And the current's going to loop around like that. And we want to know what is the current. Well, the current in this problem, uh, you need to know the uh, you need to know this formula that the current is equal to the voltage divided by the resistance. And in this problem, the voltage is 12 volts, and the current is 6 ohms, which gives you a total of 2 amps. And that's how you solve for the current in this one. You just get the voltage divided by the resistance, or, yeah, divided by the resistance, and that gives you the, the current. So let's go on to the second problem, and again, we're going to solve for current. But in this problem, we're going gonna, to gonna add a little twist to it. So in these problems, I'm just hoping to, to build it up a little bit more each time. So now in this power supply, this power supply is equal to 24 volts. And there it is. Now I just draw circles with a plus and minus, but sometimes you might see them a little bit differently. I'll draw them the way they're sometimes drawn in other circuit books. So here, this is R1. The first resistor is R1. And that's equal to 12 ohms. And this second resistor, this is R2, and that is equal to um, 6 ohms. Now here we want to solve for the current again, so let's solve for the current. So in order to solve for current, we're going to need to know what is the voltage and what is the resistance. Um, so here you notice that you have two resistors, and resistors in series, they, they just sum together. So the way you would add these resistors, you would get uh, the total resistance. So I'm going to call the total resistance in the circuit RT. And I'm going to say that's equal to R1 plus R2. R1, R2. And you just add them together because they're, they're additive. So R1 is 12 ohms plus 6 ohms, which gives you a total of 18 ohms. So the total resistance of the circuit is 18 ohms. Now we can solve for the rest of it. Um, so when you solve for this, you, you could just use, since we want the total current, which is a current going through the entire system, you can just use the this formula, which is the current is equal to the voltage of the supply divided by the total resistance. And that's going to be equal to 24 volts divided by the 18 ohms and that's going to be equal to um, uh, roughly 1.33 amps or one and a third amps and that's what the current's going to be equal to so let's go on to the next problem actually no i'm going to stop it here i don't want to make these videos too long so i, I hope you like this video if you did please like it uh, it's, and if uh, I'm going to be making more videos that are a little bit more complicated, so uh, look out for those. So hopefully you'll watch the next ones.